Hey guys, it's Wolf of Valhalla Gaming and we are back in Hardcore Minecraft, so you know what that means. If I die, everything we've built goes away. That includes our lovely farm, our barn, and our mine. So I'm going to go to sleep right now. And we're going to go back to the mine and I'll give y'all somewhat of a little bit of a tour, I suppose. And then we'll do some mining because I didn't really find too many diamonds last time. Really hoping for a lot more, uh, to be fair only got two last time. I think uh, I need a few more if I'm going to be building some suits of armor and some stuff like that. But we are going to go ahead and bring our composter to our farm where it belongs. Ow, ow, ow. Stupid purple berries. Bastards. Oh, look at how cute everything is. And now we just have all these wheat seeds that we can dump in there. Do these give you experience points? I don't know if this gives you experience points. I don't think it does. It does not look like it does. But it is a fast way to get rid of all of these extra seeds we have. Another fast way, I guess, would be turning that farm over there into a... Uh, into another wheat field. But I'm going to save it for carrots whenever we find it. That way I can breed my piggies. Because while we have plenty of our different sheeps and our cows, we're lacking on the pigs. And that's just not good. It's not very good at all. But we are going to get some bone mill. We're probably going to work on the house for these five days. If we can find some more diamonds relatively quick. If not, it'll be another five days of mining. Because I'd like to start getting some diamond equipment so we can start enchanting soon. And uh, if we can start enchanting soon, then maybe we could actually start going to places like the nether. Ooh, the nether terrifies me. I need golden armor if I'm going to go there. We do have a decent amount of bone meal, though, so that'll make harvesting some things a little bit easier, I guess. I wonder if there's a automated way to do this. If I put a hopper on top of one of these and then a hopper under it, would it automatically feed? Hmm, interesting. Ideas, ideas. Do y'all know if hoppers will automatically give me bone meal? Can we build an automated bone meal farm? Is that a thing? Can I put a hopper attached to this? I'll probably hop off after this and test that in creative. Oh, there we go. Okay, so we've got our bone meal. Um, I think our animals here deserve a little bone meal. They're eating a little bit, so we'll bone meal their areas up a little bit and give them some grass and stuffs make it a little bit more comfortable for them you know and then we'll trim the outside don't give me seeds i don't need your seeds and we get some pretty flowers too and put the flowers right here i don't know where to put these flowers they can go over here perfect it is kind of dark in here don't have torches Okay, so I'm going to grab torches, make torches, something, and then we're going to go into the mine. So let us go get some torches. should probably start making some lanterns too and then work on the house a lot more. I've not added much to the house in a while. Three. Uh, these seeds can go here. We'll take some of this. I have plenty of iron though. Holy crap. Plenty of iron, some stakey boys. No, that's not what I wanted to do at all. There we go. Okay, and I've got some extra coal, and I'll bring some wood with me. Yeah, I'll bring uh, some oak planks with me, just in case we need some stuff. Some coal, and we'll leave the bone meal with these. Our golden apples. Okay. Let us go to the mine, do a semi-grand tour of it. I think I went over it last episode? I can't remember. Really can't remember. Oh well. I was also thinking about what to do with our mine, like how I want to design everything, but that's also something for another day. Ooh, more coal. So we're going to hop on down, now that everything's nice and exposed like this. It's such a long walk down, jeez. Nope, I hear skellies. No, no. Let's hopefully not have anything in our mind waiting on us to kill us. 
Hello? Hello? Anyone home? Hello? Hello? Alright, it doesn't look like there's too much in the mine waiting to kill us. Which is a benefit. For now. Eventually we'll want things to come after us. But for now, we don't. Um, I'm gonna build a little ramp up into this area. You know, maybe start blocking this lava off. I don't really need lava currently. Okay. We're gonna do this. Do 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 do. Clean. Are you kidding me? There's been diamond here the whole time. Well, that makes three diamond. That means we can have our first diamond tool. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. I love it. Speaking of which, do I have any more iron down here? I'm probably going to need to make another pickaxe while I'm down here. I heard a skelly boy. He drew his arrow. He has notched it. Oh! Where'd I get shot from? Where am I getting shot from? Oh! No. Bad skellies. Jeez, he scared me. Where did he come from? I thought I had this area well lit up. Oh, he had to have, like, spawned in something right there, maybe? Tisk, tisk, tisk. I'm not dying just because I have arrows. Or just because you want to kill me. Oh, he came from up here, probably. Okay. Probably spawned in this area. Shot me in the back of the head. That wasn't very nice of him. But, now that we've done this, we're going to keep going. And I kind of want to expand the roof a little bit, so... We're going to go up one on the roof, and this is probably going to be a time lapse. So I will see y'all when I get done. <laughs> there's diamonds in my ceiling. So we're going to collect these diamonds really quick too. Looks like there's at least four. I can do it four diamonds. Ooh, more. Can always deal with more. That was five diamonds. That puts our total at eight. I think a full set of armor is what, 24? That's not bad. That's not bad at all. Let's get rid of all this stuff. All this gravel. There we go. I almost completely forgot about the old trick to get rid of gravel really fast like that. That was pretty cool. I didn't expect to find diamonds in the ceiling. So let's go bring our diamonds back. Because now we have nine, which means I can do a pickaxe, a hatchet, and probably... Grab some obsidian and do an enchanting table. Mmm, we're gonna get spooky. Very witchy. We're gonna get witchy. Hello, my animals. English was not my friend. Hello, my animals. It is me, your king. I have returned. I must bring my loot back to my house. Yes, 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 yes. More diamonds, more diamonds. I've got six, and I had two before. It gives me eight. Okay, yeah, eight. Got some bones. <gasps> Can I get you a girlfriend yet? Do I have enough bones for that? Really don't have enough arrows for it, that's for sure. 
Regardless, that's enough for... Do I want armor or do I want tools? I think tools. I've been pretty good about my... Uh, I need sticks first, don't I? I'm a fool. There we go. Alright. So we're not going to do two diamond pickaxes, but we are going to do one. Then we're going to do these. And then that should pretty much leave me... Yep. And it's perfect timing. The ending of day... I think it's 35. 36. I can't remember. It is 36. We're going into day 37, ladies and gentlemen. And we have diamonds! So happy. Diamonds make me a happy person. We also have a bit of steel, or iron, not steel. So we're going to make a new iron pickaxe. Actually, we're going to make like three, or at least another two iron pickaxes, because we do want some more diamonds. We are going to go back into the mine and find some more diamonds, ideally, because now I'm getting greedy. I have enough, but I need, uh, I need more. I'm going to start getting greedy now. So we're going to go look for some more diamonds. And now that we know our mine is actually producing diamonds, we just need to know where to look. So I'm gonna go into the mine for a little bit. Probably won't be down there for too long. And then we're gonna come up and do some work on the house, build an enchanting table. It's gonna be a great time. And then we get to start harvesting cows and stuff because I really need leather for books so I can make bookcases. Actually, there is that village. I wonder if they had bookcases that I looked over. Okay, so find diamonds. Go to village steal books. Build enchanting room. Enchant. Infinite monies. Okay. Well, I kind of want to build up here. I'm going to go away from the mine for a little bit. So I will see everybody in just a little bit. Well, the gods have smiled upon us. We have found eight more diamond. That is enough to... That gives us ten more... Ten, ten diamonds now? We're at ten diamonds. That's pretty good. Just mining along here and got some obsidian. Decided to follow the path of the lava and got some diamonds along the way. That was pretty good. A little unexpected. Pretty good. That makes me happy. And that wasn't that far from my actual mine. I just kind of was drilling one by one holes, trying to see if there's any resources and found a cave. That's pretty good. That makes me kind of happy. Today's episode's going so much better than last Monday. Last Monday was a nightmare, and I only found two. Can you imagine if I found another batch? That would be amazing. Ooh, this place looks so interesting. So excited to be in here. Sorry, I just want some redstone. It's easy experience points, and I'm going to need that if I'm going to start. Um, why can't I English right now? If I'm going to start uh, enchanting words, they don't work. So we're going to see what's around this corner. Looks to me like there's just more lava, but I need to make a walkway around anyway, so that's a pretty easy fit. Ooh. It doesn't look like there's an easy walkway around this lava. Looks like we have to make one. Also sounds like there's an archer somewhere. I don't like that. Oh! Well, that was an interesting moment. Hmm, how do I deal with this without dying? Where's the skeleton at? There he is. Come on. Come towards me and I'll just mine out the block under you and you'll fall in the hole. It's pretty easy, right? You would think that they would understand this concept by now. Look, I'm just here trying to survive, my guy. If you could just, like, leave me alone. My guy. 
I'm gonna need you to calm down, okay? You and your friend already had enough fun. I don't want to deal with drop creepers and some explodey boys. Really, not my type. Sorry to inform you. Where are you? Oh, there you are. Okay. Uh, he's right over the lava, isn't he? Ow! Yes! It worked. Terminator. <laughs> Except he's not going to be back. And then we're going to cover up this danger hole. Because I already collected enough obsidian for now. And then we'll torch it. Perfect. Ooh, more iron up here. And another skeleton from the sounds of it. Not going to bother him. He can do his own thing. I'm here for exploration purposes only. I just want to see what's going on in the other half of my mine shaft. Really don't like hearing skeletons while I'm this close to lava. Ooh, lapis lazuli. Love some lapis. Need that for enchanting too. Oh, there goes that pickaxe. Perfect. I love lapis. Also can dye some of my sheep blue now. I've had really good luck with finding diamonds in previous playthroughs where I just, like, follow these lava pits around. Maybe not so much in this one, though. Then again, I did just find that block of eight on that other lava pit, so maybe. Who knows? Open up this area a little bit. I don't even know what day it is. I th 37. Still. So we're not doing too bad. Oh! Oh! You don't say! Well, don't mind if I do. Oh! Hello. Is that another eight diamonds I've collected? Does that make my total 16 diamonds in one trip? This is so much better than the last episode. Oh. Oh, that was... Why do I have this hold here? Why would I not be a smart person and cover it up? Oh, God. I did that to myself, didn't I? All right, all right, all right. That makes me happy, 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 happy. I also do kind of want to just expand this hole and keep going forward, though. I feel like there might be more resources somewhere in this area. I just don't know where. There's a lot of redstone. That's going to be good for us later on. We're going to stay down here until day 38, and then we're going to go back up. Hey, look, emeralds. Emeralds are always actually pretty good. Love emeralds, love redstone, love everything. It gives us all nice experience points. More emerald. Yay. Where's this emerald? Give me that. All right. And give me this redstone. Am I mining into the lava pit by accident? I don't think I am. Just keep punching through. And I will see you all... On day 38. Unless something extraordinary happens. Alright guys, we're back. Uh, not too much else in the mine. Found some minor resources. Some emeralds, some more iron. Things like that. Get it? Minor resources. Hey. Anyway. <clears throat> we're going to smelt that. We're going to take our diamonds up top. And we're going to go do some other stuff. Because it's almost day 40. We've got two more days left on this episode. And I'm surprised I've made it this far. I really am. A hundred days in hardcore Minecraft, and I'm still kicking. Well, almost 40 days. We're almost halfway there. And then maybe I'll do 200 days of hardcore Minecraft, if y'all are interested. But now we have this, which means we need to make our enchanting room. This is going to be this room right here. If I remember, it goes like this, like this. There should be some wood right here. 
Um, spruce planks, preferably. Do we have any? We do have some spruce. Okay. So you take some spruce, you continue the path, and then it steps down one, and then it's... So it's going to be right here. Like this. And then it goes all the way around. It goes one, two, three, four, five. That's a... Uh, I hate how I designed these rooms. I just can't remember how I built them. Let's see if I can't get this right the first try. That's what? One, two. So we got three, four, or three. That's one, two, three, four, five. Perfect. Then we'll just put a torch in here for now. Um, obviously the ceiling's also going to have to come up. Which is also going to be a nightmare, but that's something else to, entirely to deal with. Because now we need books, and an enchanting table, and a floor in here. So we'll start with the simple things. Let's grab the floor. I think I did spruce wood. Did I do sprucey wood, or did I do dark oak? Ooh... I think that's dark oak. It's definitely dark oak. Do I have any more dark oak? I have stairs. Dark. Oh, I have plenty of dark oak. Okay. So let's get this. Let's put some of this cobble back up. Some other resources I've managed to gather. Sure, we'll do that. That, that. Good enough. Clean enough for now. And we're going to start working on this, which means I'm going to need to take some of these and do our floor. An enchanting room is just a three by, or a five by five, I think, normally. And this is gonna oh that ray oh the ray tracing is so pretty oh look at it okay and then you do some slabs really quick like so you take said slabs and you put them on the ground like that and then the enchanting table will go right here Which realistically means I just need the wall to be one, two, three. It's not going to be a very big room, I suppose, because then there will be another wall here. These are all for bookcases. I forgot how to make bookcases, so we're going to find out. I know I need books, which means I need sugarcane, and I'm so glad I have my sugarcane farm. So and that's not how I wanted you to go. Give me my iron axe. Thank you. There. <clears throat> it's so pretty. Oh, it's so pretty. Look at our farm and everything else. Okay. Anyway. Let's store the rest of this up. Dark oak and everything. We'll put our goodies away over here. Actually, we're going to keep one for the enchanting table. And we're going to make some armor we're gonna upgrade also how do i make an armor stand i want to retire my my trusty iron armor here especially if we're doing gold or diamond armor so i'm gonna need some sticks i assume maybe i mean can i make an armor stand uh, what about now Hmm, how do I make an armor stand? Curious. Can I even make an armor stand? How does one make an armor stand? Give me two seconds, I gotta look it up. It's okay, it's going into the daytime, nighttime anyway, so... Armor... Stand... Minecraft. Oh, I need a slab. I need a smooth stone slab. Does that mean I need to put some cobble in here? 
Because that gives me smooth stone, doesn't it? Or does it just give me stone and then you have to smelt it again? Pretty sure it just gives me stone and then you take that stone and you smelt it again. And it gives you like polished stone and then you make a slab out of that. I'm not sure. Maybe? Okay, so it does, yeah, it gives you smooth stone. And I need a smooth stone slab, which means we're going to do this twice. Yep. Okay. Perfect. And then we smelt the... Oh, no. That ah! Why are you in my house, my guy? My, my guy, I, I'm going to need you to get out. I'm sorry. If you could not be in my house, that'd be real nice. How did he get in? What witchcraft is this? I don't have a pump. Pumpkin? Do I have pumpkins? I thought I had pumpkins somewhere. We're just gonna do this the right way. We're just gonna ignore him. He's not a real person. Um, I'm gonna take some iron here. I'm gonna make some shears. Yep, we're going to do this, and then we're going to do that, and then we're going to put the pumpkin head on, and should be able to look at him, right? Cool. I know this affects gameplay, but I'm not risking it with him in my house. I'm sorry. I can't see crap out of this. Oh, my gods. All right, now we can make an armor stand. All right? It said an armor stand, it was this, and then it's one, two, one, one, two, three. So I can make an armor stand. Okay, whatever. We're gonna... Oh, there's a thing there. Okay. Time to start making some diamond armor. So the legs need one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. chest take a large amount and that leaves us two left which means that we are going to replace our chest plate and our legs and we will put them on our little person over here um item frame i need to frame up my well-earned axe here since I have a diamond one now that will soon be enchanted. Also, enchanting table. How do I make an enchanting table? Oh, boy. Enchantment table recipe. One book, two diamonds, four obsidian. What? Okay, that makes sense now. So I need a book. Um, I don't think I've collected a book in my travels just yet, have I? I do not have a book just yet. Okay. So we're going to make a book. But first we're going to go to bed, so hopefully it's not going to let me... Okay. Um, how am I going to do this? He's going to knock the crap out of me as soon as I try and get him out of here. He can't come through here, though, I don't think, because it's a... He definitely can't come in here, right? It's too short. We're going to make sure he can't get in here, because it's only too tall, technically. <clears throat> Alright, this is going to get me killed, I know it is. Lay down. Is he gone? I think he might be gone. I think I'm safe. I think it worked. Okay, let's put our arrow back, put our busted bow and arrow back, and put all of our redstone back. Um... God, that was terrifying. Why was he in my house? Strange individual in my house. 
Take this off, put my normal helmet on. Okay, so we're going to go see if there's any books from that village that I traveled to last, a few episodes ago. Um, emerald, don't really care, lapis lazuli, coal. I'm going to keep you with me just in case. Keep some bones on me just in case, keep that pickaxe on me. Okay, we're going to do that. What day is it? Is it? It's day 39, so we've got another day until day 40, and we'll be like over a third of the way there now. So we're going to run to this village that's way out to here. <clears throat> oh, I apologize for my voice. It's kind of early in the morning. Ooh, it's a piggy. Okay, so there's the village. It's out there. There's also lava in the way. Almost forgot that was a thing. There's also a lot of horses and stuff around here. Hmm. It's quite lovely. Minecraft with shaders is just so pretty. Such a simple game that made so pretty. I should probably try and tame a horse sometime, but I don't have a saddle. Alright, let's see what the villagers have left over from their fire that they had that I had no part in causing. I don't care what the raven says. I did not cause a fire. Well, here's their path. So we just climb up here. And their path kind of sucks, but we're just going to modify it. We're going to see what's in this house. Books, crafting table, empty chest, blue bed. You get to keep yours. What about this one? Books, 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 yes, no, maybe. Nope, abandoned, purple bed. Are there any villagers even left alive here? Oh, there is. He's trapped inside of the thing. Interesting, interesting indeed. Hmm. No books yet. It's kind of disappointing. Maybe I'll just have to make books on my own then. Means I'll have to start slaughtering my cows more. It's kind of disappointing. I was expecting more. There's a cat over there. Also, what are you animals doing? Be free, heathens. Oh, the villagers are over there. Okay. There's a whole bunch of them over here. I don't know what they're doing. What's up, guys? Hmm. So, no books over here. Kind of ends. I think the rest of the houses are down here. It's kind of a shitty village. Not gonna lie. Don't have too much going on for them. Don't even have any books. Probably stole that guy's bed at one point in time. That looks like a dangerous place to go. Nice well, though. Very nice. Use that for inspiration in my later days. Uh, no books in the burned down house. Who would have guessed? And none from you, huh? That's a hell of a fall, my guys. Like, why would you ever do that to yourself? At least find a safe way down like that. I remember last time I was here, there was some scary, spooky stuff going on down there, and I want nothing to do with it. Mm. Nothing. Alright, well, these villagers were completely and utterly useless, so we're going to have to start turning sugarcane into paper and cows into leather. And with the power of that, we shall make our own... Ooh, I almost fell in that water. We shall make our own books, and we shall write them, and it will be the history of the New Lunar Republic. Sure, that's going to be the name of our village, New Lunar Republic. That's a hole in the ground, and it will tell the stories of their great king who bested the Minecraft creatures for a hundred days more. And a hundred days after that, and his kingdom grew and grew until he took over the entire realm.
Okay. So what's going to happen here is um, I'm going to feed you cows a little bit of wheat. Crops are pretty much done. No, nothing I can't care about. I don't even know why that's here anymore. It just has no purpose at this point. These gates do nothing. Except that gate. That gate protects everyone from hell. <clears throat> okay, so we're going to harvest this. We're going to feed the enemies. And here we go again with a million miles an hour of harvesting crops. Yes, yes, yes. More than enough wheat to feed the animals. Should probably make an iron farm at some point. I don't know if I want to do that. I'm not much of a farm, like, automated farming type of person. Something satisfying about the little things in Minecraft. Like building a farm. And feeding yourself with it. And then feeding villagers with it. Because villagers love potatoes. We need to harvest the potato crops, too. Then we can start eating baked potatoes for every meal. We can have so much bone meal. Or we can build another field to harvest crops. I don't know yet. We're going to do something, though. Alright, so we've now got enough wheat. We're going to harvest the sugar cane now so I can make paper. Because I think, what, it's... Three leather and three paper for a book? I don't really know. E, I don't know how to make anything. I'm not a Minecraft veteran. Definitely gonna Google book recipe. Because we need to make our enchanting table. We only need one book to make the table, and then we need a lot to make everything else. Alright. Feed. Make me babies. Make babies. Make babies. Okay, babies have been made. Make babies. Give me children. And then something really sad is about to happen here. I'm gonna need a lot of you to pass away. Just aim at head height and eventually they die. Actually, how much damage do you do? This axes always just do nine. Okay, we have a little bit of leather. Um, those babies have no one to take care of them now. Uh, but we can grow them up. The benefit of wheat, you can make babies grow up. I think. I thought you used to be able to make them grow up. Is a specific one? I don't know. Okay, whatever. I have enough food, so I'm just going to give the rest of the wheat to the kids. They just watch their families die. Okay. Then we get rid of our extra seeds really quick, because we have a crap ton. And we get our bone meal from it. Yes. Also, I just heard a zombie. Don't know how I feel about that. I'm supposed to be safe here. We only got seven leather for all of that? Oh, that's heinous. That is disgusting. I need more leather. Do llamas give you more leather? And is there a more humane way of killing? Maybe if I did a fire aspect on my axe, it would do more. Hmm... And yes, I know the sword does less damage than the axe, but the sword is faster, so I'm not really sure if it matches. I guess it's a damage per second thing. Uh, I'm not really sure, like, the actual numbers that go behind it. But let's get some sugar cane. Ow, ow. Stop it. Oh, there's an ink sack. Interesting. Perfect. Whole bunch of sugar cane. And then we can go inside and work on the enchanting table. Control? 
Okay, that's how you do it. Okay, that makes sense. Okay. Now we have 42 sugar cane. There should be enough for a little bit of paper. And this is how we're going to end this day. We're going to make paper. I can make bone blocks. Ooh. can make leather horse armor. Mmm. Paper. Uh, yeah, sure. We make 42 paper. Okay. Now I need to make a book. How do I make a book? I have leather. Okay. Well, we're going to Google how to make a book. All right. <laughs> book recipe, Minecraft. Let's see. Three papers, one leather, and a three by three. Okay, so three... In what pattern? Oh, is it literally just... That? Oh, okay. Does it have to be capital when I type it in? Okay. Oh, now I can craft them. Alright, well how many can I craft? Alright, now how do I make a bookshelf? I need one book for the enchanting table, and then I need bookshelves. So let's start looking. Look at that. It's coming along. Oh, I forgot to take these down. Oops. I wonder if that Enderman is still angry at me. Is he going to come back in a few moments? He's just at the gym training right now. He's going to come back and beat me. <clears throat> oh, I need my diamond. Because we're finally going to make our enchanting table. So I think it was... What was enchanting table recipe? I forget. Oh no, it was two diamonds, wasn't it? It's two diamonds, four obsidian, and one book? I can't remember. I think it was this, this, yes. We now have an enchanting table. It's getting spooky now. And now I need a bookshelf, and I don't know how to do that either. I assume it's just going to be wooden planks combined with books. Bookshelf, there we go. I can make two of them. So it's three per. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Alright. Could get efficiency one. We're going to need to do better than that. So next episode, we're going to work on enchanting tables. Definitely. Because now we have it. I put my one diamond back, I guess. Got <laughs> <clears throat> some raw beef that needs to be cooked. Oh, yeah. so sorry about my voice. Should probably get some water after this. But that is the end of day... 39. We are going to go into day 40. Maybe I made all the paper. I made all the books I can. I gotta wait for all that to regrow. Um, don't. Oh, I do have some extra weed, I guess. I could go feed the children. Oh, I didn't even make all the books I could, could I? I need more leather. Do I have any extra leather just laying around? I could have swore I had extra leather at one point from some stuff I killed. Maybe not. Hmm. This is why, also why I just need to sort some of my inventory better. <laughs> my inventory is kind of shot. <clears throat> but it doesn't mean that I can't go out and kill some innocent cows that I saw on open land. I just won't kill my cows as much. Also, I'm pretty sure llamas give you leather, so I may start a llama farm. I don't know how humane that sounds, but it sounds like a thing I might do. Also, free arrows and free bones. Don't mind if I do. Alright, so those... Are these cows grown yet? I don't think they are. Okay. So the cows that I saw were in this general area. So I need one leather 
per book. I need three books per thing. Did you even give me leather? Your death was in vain. Ooh, horses give you leather too. Turn away, children. Nothing's about to happen here. Did you give me leather? No? You gave me two leather. Ooh, come here, cow. Come here. More leather. That's four books. Almost another two enchanting tables. There's five. I also don't see any horses that are the color I want, so we're just going to exterminate them anyway. I swear it's ethical. Don't look at me. Well, if you won't let me be your friend, then I'll be your enemy. Okay. Well, that solves our horse issue. <clears throat> they were predatory, invasive species. Yeah. Wolves, definitely okay. Um, horses, on the other hand, they're, they're monsters. They destroy everything they touch. We have to keep their population under control. No horses were made in the filming of this Minecraft episode. I'm gonna get some pork chops, too. Nom noms. Have I really not killed a pig yet? Interesting. Well, now that I've reduced the spawn rate of everything in this area... Chickens. Real shame. Real shame. Oh, I could have swore there was a wolf over here at one point that I wanted to tame, too. Oh, there's wolves. There's another one. Can we get a girl wolf for the other wolf and have a wolf army? We might. Let's get more wolves. I don't know how many bones I have right now. I have four bones. Hopefully it's enough. Hello? Hi. Senior Doge. <gasps> New friend. Friend gets food. I get my food. Where's your other friend? I just saw them wander off. Doge. Doge. Doge, come here. No, don't hide under a tree. He was like my dog in real life. <gasps> Another. The pack. The pack grows. Another. Dang, you're the stubborn one, huh? Okay. I'll take two. Now we can breed an army together. Let's go, my new friends. Onward. Get some fishies, too. Maybe we can get some cats and leave them around the property. Ooh, there's lava. Doges, watch out. Please don't step in the lava. I'm not going to lose any doges. Not today. Not ever. No doges will be lost in the making of this episode. Need a faster way to travel. Shake out the wet fur. Alright, so I've got a blue one already, so I guess I need to make some different colored dyes for my doges. I've got black. I can have a black one. How do I make purple? Is it a flower? It's probably a flower, isn't it? Doges! You can go there. Hello! Look, his new family! You come to bedroom. We all, we all sleep. This is Pack. We are Pack. His wolf and his wolves. Hello. 
No, no, do not climb the stair. Okay, you know what? I will put one of you on that stairs, and the other one can come all the way to the staircase. That would have been actually kind of entertaining. Can I push you up the stairs? They will be the dogs that watch forever upon my kingdom. Let's just push you up this staircase. Perfect. Don't they look so comfortable? <laughs> Don't my guardians look so comfortable? <laughs> oh, where is... I've got some ink sacks. I can dye their colors black. Oh, I need to turn it into black ink. So he's a black dog. He's in his ink. We have a lapis dog already. Um, don't have any purple flowers laying around, do I? I don't think I do. I have red flowers, though. Can probably get some red. Oh, I can do a uh, red doge, maybe. Red doge. Yeah. Plenty of red flowers. There we go. And we have rose bushes. So we have a red, a black, and a blue dog for now. And we'll then make some more books. And we will finish with our enchanting table. Or we'll kind of finish the enchanting room. Doge! Oh, you're already a red doge, aren't you? Hmm. Okay, well, we'll just have our guardians here. Guardian 1, Guardian 2. Look, guys, I, I need names. Y'all are gonna have to help me. I need names. Okay, so we're done with all of this. Let's make books. Books. How many books can we make? Seven? Which means we can make another two of these. Yes, yes, yes. Perfect, perfect, perfect. My enchantment's going up yet? Can I enchant? Efficiency 1, unbreaking, efficiency 1. Really not impressed. Efficiency 1, unbreaking 1, efficiency 1. Not impressed again. Do better. You're in charge of enchanting. Do better. Alright. We've done that. I really can't enchant too much else until the cows are ready for breeding, I guess. And I can harvest some more sugarcane. I'd make an automated sugarcane farm, but I kind of like the way it looks. It's kind of pretty. Not gonna lie. Kind of like it. I really like the way our town is coming. Well, not our town yet. I haven't built any walls in a while. Could start adding some additional walls, I suppose, so we can start adding houses and stuff and other buildings here. Maybe in next week's episode we'll expand our walls and start on adding some small villager houses and things like that. Something that has not happened since the very beginning of the game is I have not found pillagers. So... I don't know when I'm going to get raided, if I'm ever going to get raided, because I don't know where a pillager tower is, and I just don't know where the pillagers are. Is, is what I'm living in considered a base, or like a village now? Very confused. If y'all know the answer to that, please let me know. There's a whole butt ton of pigs up there. Soon, soon, nether portal, you will be reactivated. And then the end will come. But speaking of the ends of things, it is getting dark, which means that it is the end of day 40. So I would like to thank all of you for joining. <laughs> and as always, we will see you next time. Bye, guys.